Southern Rail Fan is the place for amazing videos of all types of trains. Southern Rail Fan, subscribe today. Okie dokie, we're getting our day started off here early Sunday morning down on Old Glenwood Road just south of Marion. And you can see there back behind me a little bit, it's a bunch of Duke Power workers. We're waiting on northbound CSX S989, a high and wide with a huge uh, electrical transformer on it. And we're gonna catch them uh, unloading that transformer here, which should be pretty cool. What they're going to do, they're going to pull up past this crossing up behind me and uh, break away that uh, gondola and the locomotive and pull on north of this crossing and get that big transformer uh, unloaded. I'm back far enough where I can't see anybody's faces. And that box car is just a buffer car for the rear of the train. Gonna move on up and center that uh, transformer and a half right now. on their unloading platform. He stopped short of the siding just to make sure that uh, everybody was clear and safe for him to proceed. All 
righty. Now they're building a platform on each side of the car. And from what I understand, they'll uh, put metal I-beams in between the car and the uh, generator, or uh, not the generator, whatever, that transformer, yeah, transformer, and lift that thing up. And uh, it has wheels on it, and it'll roll it right off uh, to the left here, and they've got a platform built uh, for it to sit on. Uh, they'll roll it off far enough where it won't be in the uh, foul in the, the main line there. So it's been a pretty cool operation. I'm hoping to get some more uh, footage. I'm staying back. I'm not going to get any up close footage because uh, as uh, a rule for my channel, I don't film anything where you can see somebody's face. Okie doke, they've uh, built a similar platform on the other side as you see there. They've uh, really took the time to get it level and now they're putting some cribbing underneath and getting ready to use some bottle jacks. And they're gonna raise that transformer up about six inches and uh, slide it off to the right hand side. Pretty cool operation. Okie dokie, on the other side of that trailer there, a trailer, on the other side of that depressed center flat car is a trailer with a bunch of wheels and it's a remote control trailer and it's got a little motor i don't guess a little motor big motor down in it and they've slid that transformer off or almost off of the uh depressed center flat car and onto that trailer and it's that trailer literally has wheels like a tractor and trailer all the way up it and all the way across it and it's remote control and they've been moving it around so right now they're kind of busting it uh to get this flat car cleared off because they had a six hour window to get the uh, main line here on the Blue Ridge sub uh, open back up. So uh, they've done all their safety testing and all that stuff and now they're kind of moving along at a pretty good pace. But uh, I ruined my video and Blue Ridge Dave's video because I was sitting over there running my mouth with some fabuloso story and we both missed it moving over there. So sorry about that. But we'll get some more footage here in just a second. Okie doke, that was pretty awesome. Kind of a long drawn out process though. Uh, but the crews both with the company that owns the uh, depressed center flat car that was doing the transporting, Duke Power, and of course, CSX crews are always the best. Everybody down there was uh, very nice to us. Of course, we let them know when we got there what we were gonna be doing and, and uh, how we film. And uh, just like I've always said, if they don't have to worry about you, they don't have to worry about you. Makes sense. Anyway, loved it. Got to spend some time with some good friends. And uh, that's the first time I've ever seen that process happen. They jacked it up, placed those rails underneath both that uh, moving platform and the depressed center flat car and moved that transformer right over and after they got all their safety checks and everything done i mean they were measuring using a level all this stuff to get it get it right uh it moved very very quickly i mean like, like, but compared to the uh time uh, the rest of the day went it went pretty quick so hope you enjoyed that and i'll be back out trackside tomorrow see what i come up with see you guys then